always will be fine. Try to make you love. Everything's forgotten. I know you hate that. Kiss you once or twice Everything's forgotten I know you hate that I love you Sunday song Week's not yet begun Everything is quiet It is always you It was always you and me, always. How's it going folks, this is Wayne Arr, back with another lesson and an amazing song as always today. We're looking at the Wanna Dies and the You and Me song. Anyone who went to indie discos back in the 90s, this song was always played. So I've got, you know, fond memories of this song. And one or two of you have requested this song. I've never thought of this song before. It's always a song of light. Like I say, an indie disco wouldn't be the same about this song. And it's great fun to play. Not an easy strumming pattern, but I'll sort of break it down and show you the way that I played. So uh, there we go. Now, if you do want the chords, lyrics and strumming pattern to this song and everything I've done over the past three and a half years, just over now. So there's a link to that in the comments. I'll also put a link in the description. And the way that that works, you just click on the link, sign up for as little as a couple of quid a month or however much you guys want to pledge. It's all very much appreciated. It all generally goes back into the lessons. And it gives you guys access to, as I say, not only this song, pretty much everything I've done over the past three and a half years, just over now. So there's a lot of content up there. There's some exclusive videos that aren't on YouTube. There's a lot of videos from the archive. And there's stuff to coincide with some of the technique lessons I've done as well. So if you're into the scales and blues stuff, you know, exercises, strumming lessons and things like that, the sort of stuff to coincide with that as well. So what you're waiting for, link in the comments, link in the description. If you don't want to do that and you'd like to show some appreciation in a different way, I've got a new feature, which you'll find just underneath the video there. It's a super thanks link. You can click on that and make a small donation again. Very much appreciated. Uh, thanks for your continued support. Thanks everyone who's subscribed and continues to do so. Now, if you are subscribed and you haven't done already, a further way that you could help me out and yourselves out by keeping up to date with all the videos that are put out is sitting that little notification bell. Again, you'll find that just underneath the video there. And please go over and give me a like on social media if you want to. So you'll find me on Wayne R Guitar on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and now also TikTok, as you always say. I'm trying to get down with the kids. Anyway, that's enough of me rambling. Without further ado, let's get to it. Okay, so the song is in standard tuning, and the chords to the verse are going to be a D major 7. So I do that by barring the E, the B, and the G string, also playing the open D string. That's called a D major 7. We've got an E minor 7. So the way we do that, we just take a regular E minor chord, put the third finger on the third fret on the B string. We've got an F sharp minor and a G6. So if you've never come across a G6 before, it's just a regular G chord and you're just, you know, going to keep fingers 1 and 2 on the A and the E string, play all the other strings open. Really nice sounding chord. So if we just play you that, the first line we've got. Always will we fight Try to make you love Everything's forgotten No, you hate that stop on the D major 7 there and then we carry on playing the D major 7 with it ba ba da da ba 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 da da ba 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 always will we fight I kiss you once or twice everything's forgotten I know you did that I love you Sunday song not yet begun and everything is quiet and it's always okay so that's going to be a verse and the chords to the chorus are going to be a D chord an E minor an F sharp minor a G 
that's going to be your first two lines and then the ba 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 that's going to be a g a g d e minor f sharp minor and we're going to sort of stop on a g chord that takes us back into verse two so that'll be you and me So we've got exactly the same again, the only difference is, so the last chorus would sort of go around twice and uh, the last line we got the A, ba, 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 G, ba, 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 da, da. And you can finish that on the D major 7, okay? So that's pretty much, you know, the meat and potatoes of the song. Um, now the most difficult thing is probably the strumming pattern. Now you notice I put some little percussive strums in, but I'll just give you a guide pattern and then uh, I have done a standalone lesson on percussive strumming. I'm not going to go into it too in depth in this lesson, so if you want to check that lesson out you could probably, you know, get the hang of that and add it into this lesson. A basic strumming pattern, you know, around the verse chords would be down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up. Quite nice if you want to add those little percussive bits in. So what we get then is okay. So quite difficult to do that, but um, you know if you want to try and add that in. But uh, other than that, just use that basic pattern that I, you know, I suggested earlier on. And the chorus uh, is where the song picks up. I just tend to do on each chord a down, down, up, down, up, down, up. That's a down, down, up, down, up, down, up. So what we get is a... There we go, you get the idea, and that is pretty much all you're going to need. Okay, so thanks very much for watching, hope you all dug that, and as I always say at this point in my lessons, come on, if you don't like that song, you do not like music, so uh, there we go. And anyone who went to indie discos in the 90s, I think everyone will remember that song. And also a great song to play as well, a great uh, one to get down. Also, if you're just getting into bar chords, obviously there's that one bar chord in this, so it's a great song to learn. Always great to look at songs that contain just one bar chord. If you're an absolute beginner, you've never done bar chords before. So there we go. So I uh, hope you all enjoyed that. Thanks everyone who requested this song. Um, you know, there's a few of you that requested this. Uh, now, if you do want to request songs, I'll just point out the easiest way to do that is obviously comment in the comments below the video. Or if you want to find me a personal message over on those social media platforms, I suggest it at the start of the video. You're very welcome to. I just always point out that I do get quite a lot and I do have to sort of hemp it them a little bit. But don't let that put you guys off. Please do keep your requests coming because that's what keeps this channel going and it's very much appreciated. Another thing that's very much appreciated, also keeps this channel going, is uh, thanks everyone who's subscribed and continues to do so. I'll quickly mention it again if you haven't done already. Please hit that little notification bell you'll find just underneath the video there, so you can keep up to date with all the videos that are put out. The patron thing, that certainly keeps this channel going, the funding from that, so it's very much appreciated. And it gives you guys access to pretty much all the you know chords, lyrics and strumming patterns to coincide with all the lessons that I do, as well as some bonus stuff. Pretty much everything I've done over the past three and a half years, just over now, so there's a lot of content up there. So please check that out, there's a link to that in the comments 
also a link in the description i've got the super thanks link if you'd just like to make a small donation again that's very much appreciated and another way that you guys could help me out is that this doesn't cost you guys a penny but it's very effective is word of mouth word of mouth is a very powerful thing so if you dig what i do you enjoy my lessons please like and share my lessons tell your friends tell your work colleagues anyone you know plays a guitar please put them in my direction i really appreciate that so that just leads me to say whatever time of day it is you're watching maybe morning day night thank you very much and i'll catch you all for lesson very soon take care